Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can design a hair dryer using the part design and wireframe and surface design workbenches in Kitty AV5. So whatever you can see on the right side is the completed design and you can see the different views of it and on the left side what you can see is the different drawings which are required to complete the design so the cross-section uh, radius etc is all provided and you can actually refer this and uh, start off doing with me so we are over here with the tutorial and if you haven't seen the previous tutorial parts please go back to my channel and find out the previous parts because on the title I've written the different parts part 1 part 2 part 3 etc and uh, let's see how we can go ahead with the design so in this particular part I'm going to show you to create the flat boundaries flat boundaries is important because we need to convert this uh, particular surface to part so for convert converting the surface to part you, c you should actually create create the flat flat boundaries so select the line definition and create lines like this right another one over here okay that's it so we got three lines there now use the fill command which is very useful at times just select and use the fill command here 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 okay another one over here another one signal just come out let's try it again let me hide this stuff oh cannot really hide that uh let's try it again um fill command this one this one there this one up there okay this one here this one okay that creates a close contour there alright alright just click on the preview and you get the close contour so it may be a little confusing okay so I'll just show that again click on the fill command okay select this 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 right here uh, this one this one please don't click click the wrong curves okay where is the open gap? Okay, just hide that and uh, just hide that particular line and then click the edges if you get such kind of problem. Just click on OK and you get the closed surface there. And 
you have created the complete closed surface the next step is to join all of the surfaces and then convert it into uh, the part or the solid object and do some further processing and I'm going to show that in the next tutorial and that's it for this particular part I know it's a little confusing to do the fill command on the bottom but It'll, you'll get used to it once you you know work on this particular part a uh, few times and that's all uh, for this particular part let me know if you have any doubts or clarifications you can always write to me at kitsia.prorouser at gmail.com if you have uh, any CAD projects uh, which you want me to handle you can always uh, give it to me or if you want me to help you I can do that too and that's all thank you and stay tuned